this is High Street, Kensington. We are in Holland Park right now. It's a bit windy. And this is one of the famous opera centers where you can witness um, famous opera singers. So this is what we call the Holland Park. Opera Holland Park. Let's see. What is the event? I can hear some people having their. So there is one. There is one here. Opera and song. Song recitals. So there is one opera for tonight. there do their landscaping here in UK. Do you see the flower? It's, it's not actually flowers. They are wild flowers. This is a different way of landscaping. to look around and uh, if you want to play there are some people who do some chess competition here so if you fancy com doing a competition with someone you can just bring out your chess uh, playboard and someone will sit down with you and they will join you with you. Right, so it's one gloomy day, it's windy day today in Holland Park. And it's beautiful. And unfortunately the flowers are withering, they're going because they're old. And this is the same thing. It's just so nice to come and relax here when you just wanted to be alone to be on, on you know by yourself on your own and you don't want to be bothered by stress stressors or you just want to escape from the busy life of the city you just find a place to sit down and reflect get yourself busy reading a book or look at this I don't know what kind of flowers so this planting corns <laughs> so I don't know what kind of landscaping is this but maybe you can help them so this is one of their toys of plants or flowers here. I don't know, how do you find it? But for me it's I don't know, it's funny. It's 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 not very you know, pleasing in my eyes. I don't know. Maybe because it's old, it's dead, but it wasn't used to be like this. 
I prefer the tulips. It wasn't really very good at all for me. It's zero. <laughs> Maybe because the flowers are old and green. That's why it looks crap. But anyway, this lavenders are amazing. They are beautiful. Can you put your hood in Maybe those who are you know good with gardening you can suggest some ideas to our gardeners here also, I don't really know what they're doing honestly I don't really you no know, I don't like the way they combine the plants together so this is a big chessboard this is what I'm saying so if you want to have a bit of fun you can come here and play with chessboard with someone with a big you know chess and let's go to the other part of the park yes so look at that there are shades where you can sit down and hide yourself you don't want to be bothered by you know passes by and there are benches and tables around where you can take a picnic oh hello we have a friend here coming to beg a food sorry I don't have anything yeah so It's a very friendly park. This is how they look after their parks here in the UK. Like what I said during my previous vlogs, it's being maintained by charities and uh, more specifically by the lottery fund. So the lottery set aside the fund to help with the maintenance of the parks to you know to make because this is one of the tourist attraction so they make sure that they they maintain their source of fund the so that's where the the money a partial portion of the money from the lottery ticket. So this is the Kyoto Garden. It's so green. It's beautiful. This is a Kyoto Garden. It is a um, a pact. It's it's done by the Japanese um, members of the friendship pack with the UK we have a peacock hiding by the bushes there are wild wild uh, animals residing here this is perfect it's beautiful so solemn especially in the morning it's just so beautiful to sit down here just on your own to relax thinking about nothing just by yourself so this is a pond with big koi giant koi Wow. 
have to be careful not to drop myself it's dangerous it's slippery oh it's just beautiful This is done by the Japanese. It's based from their garden in Japan. So yeah, this place is massive. There are different areas of this park where you can get yourself um, relaxed. There are children's park on the other on the left side of this park. There is a place just for flowers, roses, a big garden of roses. There is a park for. training just merely for training and there is a park for sports for theater and uh, yeah it's huge let me let, let's see how it was constructed so the Kyoto garden was constructed as part of the Japan Festival in 1991.